13 Secrets to Prolong the Life of Your Phone Battery Nothing can ruin your mood faster than having a low battery on your phone and no charger in sight. To avoid the mini panic attack we all have when we see that little icon flashing at the worst time possible, try these 13 tricks to prolong your phone's battery life. 1. Turn off notifications Pretty much all mobile apps send you push notifications. On the one hand, this is convenient because you don't miss any important information. But taking advantage of this function eats up a lot of your phone's energy and kills the battery. You can turn off notifications from apps you rarely use. Keeping Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, infrared capabilities, and GPS switched off until you need to use them does a lot for your battery life as well. 2. Switch off vibration If you want to conserve energy on your phone, switch off the vibrate function. The thing is that this option uses up your battery, and, to be honest, you don't really need it. You can instead leave your phone on silent or use the ringtone setting with the volume turned down as low as possible. 3. Set your screen auto lock to the minimum how long your screen stays lit up while your phone is inactive is typically one or two minutes by default. But if you really want your battery to serve you longer, put auto lock on the shortest time available in your settings. The minimum option is usually 15 to 30 seconds, but some models even allow you to set it to 10. 4. Dim the brightness of the display. Turn the screen's brightness to the lowest setting possible, or at least as close to it as you can, while still being able to see everything. A brightly lit screen is a true battery killer, which is exactly why minimal brightness will help save your battery's life. 5. Turn off background app refresh Nowadays, most phones can automatically update your apps without bothering to ask for your approval. But, of course, this process consumes a lot of your phone's charge since the upgrades can be pretty big. 6. Switch off 3G LTE If you urgently need to save what little battery life you have left, switch off not only Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, and similar features, but 3G LTE as well. Cutting your phone's access to the internet will significantly prolong your battery life. 7. Turn on airplane mode A quick way to switch off Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, and mobile data is to put your phone on airplane mode. It doesn't usually turn off GPS though, so you'll likely still need to switch that off yourself. What's also cool about airplane mode is that if you keep it on while your phone's charging, your battery will get full faster. 8. Don't let your phone search for a signal if you're ever in an area where you have poor cell reception, your phone won't stop searching for a better connection. And doing this, it'll drain the battery. Ever forgotten to put your phone on airplane mode during a flight? Exactly! The best way to avoid this situation is to check that you have a good signal at all times. And if you notice the signal isn't perfect, just turn on airplane mode. 9. Don't wait until your battery is dead to charge your phone. We're all guilty of it, using our phones until they tragically die in our hands, and usually at the worst moment possible. Then, we plug it into the charger and wait until the battery goes from 0 to 100%. But letting the battery run all the way down actually damages it. That's because modern lithium batteries are specifically made to be charged in short, quick sessions. If that's what they're designed for, then we should do it that way. 10. Don't use additional functions If your battery is running down, or even if it's not but you just don't have a charger with you, avoid using additional functions like the camera. The flash, for example, will drain your phone's battery life in a flash. Literally. 11. Keep calls short 
A dying battery is one of the most used white lies out there when we want to end a boring conversation on the phone. But even if your battery is fine at the moment and you're chatting up a storm with your best friend, the longer you talk, the faster your battery drains. So keep it short if you don't want your phone to go black on you. 12. Adjusting network settings may help. When given a choice between 2, 3, and 4G, we all, of course, go for the biggest and best. Sure, 4G gives you a faster connection, but it uses a lot of juice to provide you with such outstanding service. When you choose 4G in the settings, both 4G and 3G radios are turned on, which is why your phone loses charge two times faster. So if you really need to save the battery, turn off 4G or even 3G and go with 2G instead. 13. Avoid animated or moving background pictures. If you like having animated wallpaper on your phone, that's cool and all, but you should know that all that moving and grooving drains your battery. If that doesn't sound like your cup of tea, keep your phone's background simple. In fact, a black one is better in this respect. When the picture is black, all the pixels are off, so your phone doesn't have to use its energy to light them. Some more tips that'll help prolong the life of your battery. Use official batteries from your phone's manufacturer. Batteries produced by other companies usually cost less, but they're also optimized worse than original ones, and this can harm your device. It's better to pay more once than spend a fortune repairing your phone. Prepare a new battery for use. If you buy a brand new phone, fully charge its battery before you start using your device. Remember that nickel-based batteries need to be charged for up to 16 hours for the first time and then run through three or four full charge to empty cycles. Lithium-ion batteries need only five to six hours for the first charge. And even if your phone tells you that the battery is full before this time is up, ignore it. If the battery hasn't been initialized, it won't work to full capacity throughout its lifespan. Don't skip on software updates. This is a super simple rule to follow. Always keep all your apps and software up to date. Each new version of a program, as a rule, is optimized better than the last one. This means that they won't be so hard on the battery. Avoid really low and high temperatures. The most comfortable condition for cell phones and their batteries is room temperature. If the temperature is lower than 32 degrees Fahrenheit, the power of lithium-based batteries decreases by 40 to 50 percent, and really hot temperatures won't do either. So avoid leaving your device in a hot car or in direct sunlight, and don't keep your phone in your pocket because your body heat will actually make it hot too. And always remember to check your phone while it's charging. If it gets too hot, there may be some problems with your charger. Lastly, put down your phone at concerts. This may just be a personal pet peeve of mine, but if you want to make sure you can text your friends or call for a ride after the show, stop taking all those far too distant photos and videos of the stage. The pictures never turn out that great, the sound on the video is lousy, plus I can assure you it's driving the people behind you crazy. Unless, of course, they're all doing the same thing. Nevertheless, try putting the phone away and enjoy the moment. You'll not only conserve your phone's battery, that's why you're there. What methods do you use to prolong the life of your battery? Have you ever had it die at the worst possible moment? Tell us in the comments below. Share this video with all your friends and family because dying batteries is a universal problem we all need help with. Give the video a like if it was useful for you and subscribe to our channel not to miss any informative and interesting videos on the bright side of life.